Hey guys, what's going on? This is Power here back today to cover Medieval Engineers, the new game from Keen Software House, makers of Space Engineers. And uh, I've been interested in this title for quite some time now. I uh, had a lot of friends who played Space Engineers and uh, they were so advanced at it, it sort of put me off jumping into it. So I'm glad we have a new even field to play on here. I'm sure there'll be a lot of similarities, but I'm looking forward to jumping in here. Now, this game is early access, guys, as you can see on the right there, and it has just been released today on the 19th of February. The game is currently creative only and single player only. Now, obviously, as development continues, there will be uh, additional modes added, multiplayer added, and so forth. But I just wanted to jump into it today and look at some of the basic mechanics, including the structural integrity thing that really looks awesome. So I'm going to quickly go for a quick start world, I guess. And we have a wonderful quote there by the <laughs> philosophical king himself, Socrates. Um, yeah, I, I sort of like Socrates. He's cool. He's cool. Although uh, most of his stuff was written down by Plato, wasn't it? He never really wrote anything down. So uh, the one thing that really appealed to me was the structural integrity that this game has when you're building things. And I saw they released a trailer for it a couple weeks ago. And that's what really, really piqued my interest in this game because it just looks so cool with some of the buildings you can build. Um, so we shall see. We shall see. It does take a little while to load here, but that's understandable because of the vast scale of the world. So we shall uh, jump into it. I know there is a survival mode planned, but creative only for now. Um, so we're given all the building blocks, all the tools, flying, I think, as well, to uh, explore the world around us. So let us... Just wait patiently here as the game loads. Any second now, any second, I can tell you guys it's going to come. Any second. <laughs> we're still going, we're still going. Or at least I think we are. Unless the game has crashed. Which you guys probably will not see this if it has. Hmm... Oh no, the cog moved. Did you guys see that? The cog is moving. We're still alive. Johnny Five is alive. And there we are. Finally, into the game. We start off with uh, a nice built castle here. I know we hit the tab key to get that away. We hit F. I think it's X for flying mode. Because we're in creative. If we hit Alt. Not Alt, is it? Uh, if I hit F1, it'll tell me the controls. How do I go in the third person? V? Okay, that's cool. V, so there I am. Engineer, just walking throughout the... <laughs> that's hilarious, look at that. Whee! But anyway, um, let us quickly go over it. And I, I want to show you one of the, the main things that I found cool about this game. So, I'm going to hit one. And I'm going to hit left mouse button here to build this block. But I want to... I think structural integrity is on. So I have dynamic building on. So if I do that and I drop this from like the sky, it should actually make an impact. Let me do it over here. Um, so let me just quickly... If I drop this... If I drop this from here... Oh! That is so cool. Uh, you can hide these hints in the game options. Let me just do that now. No, I don't want to go into help. I want to go to game. And I want to go to show hints. And okay. There we go, back onto the game itself. So, there's a variety of things we can build here, but you know what, guys? I'm going to be totally honest. I just want to blow stuff up. We have a projectile here. Um, did we throw it? There it is there, see it? So, I wonder... If I go back in the first person mode, which was... Was it J? It was V, okay. We'll go back in the first person mode. And I'll... Can I charge the shot? I can charge the shot. Oh my gosh. Would you look at that? That is crazy. Bye, 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 bye. <laughs> so let's, uh, I, I guess we should probably build a house at this point. I better jump down from uh, flying and get back in here. So V is first person, cool. G opens up our menu with all our blocks, so we have. Wow, a large projectile with 10x mass. Let's drag that down there. Uh, just for just for test sake, I want to just build a uh, cube wall here to test that out. So again, there is structural integrity enabled. So if I build this the entire way up, right? Technically, oh crap! It should break. 
because there's so much weight under one pillar that uh, it shouldn't be able to support itself, right? Ah, there we go. Look at that. That is so cool. All right, let's try this. Out. Let's see if my shooting skills are on. Oh, no. Humpty Dumpty fell off the wall. <laughs> so let's do some uh, building blocks here. Nothing really there. This is pretty cool. I think you can... I think you can actually, like, shape the world, right? With this. So if I do that... Look at that. I can create, like, a, a moss ball. That's pretty cool. So is this, like, the hill? I'll get rid of that. Pretty nice. I wonder if we can go up top in these mountains here. That would be pretty sweet. So there's our original building area. But if we go up here... Yeah, I assume that's just... Dead land. <laughs> For now. Alright, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Let's go. I, I wonder if I should build a building here. I think that's probably a good idea. Uh, I want to do that just so I can see the... Uh, the structural integrity thing in action here. So this has a plus next to it. I assume that means it has multiple variations, right? So if I do that... Yes, you can actually change the variations by hitting... Your mouse wheel. Very cool. So, dynamic building is on. I'm going to turn it off just temporarily. You, hit, you do that with J. And I think I just want to do cubes. Everything's falling. There we go. I turned it off. This is going to be the basis of my world. So if I build this out, right, this should break, technically, right? Let's give it a go. If I hit J... No, it doesn't break just yet. But you would assume it to break, right? There's only so much that can give. Aha! There we go! Wow, that's pretty sweet. That is pretty sweet. But what if I... What if I do this, right? And I think I, if I hold shift, by the way... Is it shift or alt? Can't remember. There's a button. I'm going to hit F1 and see the controls here quickly. Uh, was it... Shift plus one? No. Dynamic building mode, compound building. Block picking and flying... Um, let's go on the F1 again. Uh, let's see it. Okay, so I want to build a short house today. Again, I'm, I'm really just looking at the game right now. I'm not sure if this will be a full-blown series, because I know I'm planning to do some multiplayer with my friends. Uh, that you guys may know. In another series, when it eventually does release, but... Let's open this menu. And we have a stone pillar here. Which I'm going to drag down here to number 6. And if I take this pillar, right, and I put it there, and I put that, it has no variations. I wonder if I can switch the angle of it by pressing something. I don't know. So I get that pillar. And I bring the pillar down here. Will that support it if I bring the bridge out? I... I I'm assuming it will. There we go. There we go. That's deep in the mountain now. But is that supporting it? Yeah, it looks like it is. So, maybe I should be able to bring this out a bit more. No, it's falling. The entire thing's falling. It can't support the weight. Is there a heavier pillar? I guess it's probably a stone pillar square I was looking for there, but enough of that. Enough of that. I want to quickly go back down to base. And I think... Uh, okay, where are we at with this? Switch walk. Compound. Flying mode is X. Okay. Oh! Oh! <laughs> okay, let's go over here. And I guess my plan... Hold on, hold on. Eat. I have to do this. Ready? Does it break the trees? 
It does. Pretty cool. Alright, let's turn that off. And let's actually get building a house. Because I did say I would do that. I know there's a button I can press to actually, uh... I think it's his shift. Hold on. I don't think it is. So that's our foundation on our house. Pretty cool. What else have we got here? We got wooden wall slope. We've got a stone basement. That that road is very cool because you can actually uh, make windmills and stuff with that. But I think I want to use a wooden window wall for this one. So let's rotate it here. And we'll put that there, that there, and that there. We'll have three windows in my house because I don't really see why not. And how do I root here a piece? Uh, hmm. Oh, structural integrity view. Let's see that. Interesting. So that's okay. That's okay. Interesting. I like that. What else we got here? Block picking for B. Uh, change block variance. I don't assume that's it. Uh, open spawn. Paste object. Rotate block. Q, E, Y, and R. There we go. Q does the trick. But I don't think I want to do much of those. I only want to do three of them. Because I am going to build my house. And I can't have my house with a lot of windows. Although I do like my sunlight. I will say that much. So with that being said. That will do for the windows. We'll put the wooden walls in place here. I do need to make room for a... Uh... Oh, wow, you can't go in there? I, I know if you hold Alt, you can put a block inside a block. So I'm going to delete that. And I'm going to... Huh. Interesting how that will not go down there. I think it's because that's currently taking up that block. But I know if... You... Oh, there you go. You hold Alt to put a block inside a block. Pretty cool. I feel like Superman flying all over this place. So we'll put out. Oops. Nice. Nice. And then I will finish this off with a window there. And I need to take this away, actually. Sadly, I know. I know you guys were looking forward to that. And I'm going to put a wooden door down there. Awesome. So, how's that looking? I look structurally fine. Except for these ones. Why aren't these fine then? I'm not sure. But next up, guys, we have the roof. So, what are we going for? Are we going for a hay roof? I think we will. And again, these guys, these roofs have different variant variants. So, just look at that. So, back we go. And then we'll hit five to bring that up. That looks okay. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Can I put a block in that? Oh. <laughs> now, can I put that inside that? Yes, it does let me do that. Very nice indeed. Our little shed here is coming along nicely. So, we'll rotate this round. And I'll be looking to put that there. Put that there. And then hold Alt to put that inside a block. Oh, no. Keep on hitting flying. My alt key, I'm not used to hitting it so much. Awesome. And then we've got the rooftop here. Which is six. Looks pretty cool, right? Gonna have a baller attic up here where I'm gonna sleep. Soundtrack's very cool. I will admit that. And there we go. There is our roof, guys. Looks like a nice little house there. It would be a shame if something were having it, like 500 cannonballs. I'm just kidding. I'm not going to do that on my house. And uh, we got a corner roof here, which is pretty neat, but uh, I don't think I'm interested in that right now. I think for the most part, what I want to do right now is I'm going to build a windmill on it. And I'm going to rotate it from the inside. But what I want to do first is, uh, I guess we'll use a stone wall. Can I do that? I'm hoping I can do that. I'm hoping I can put something in here. So if I hold Alt, can I do that? 
Aww. Oh. Damn it. Um, I'll put that there and alt. Q, 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 Q. Um, we'll whack that there again. <laughs> Fix the roof after my horrible, horrible actions there. Oh, I'm not rotating it the right way, am I? Is that a rooftop? Really? Really, game? Damn, structural integrity! No, we'll get this, guys. Don't worry. We're gonna get this. I'm gonna get this today. I'm making my fancy house, I'll tell you that much. Okay, why won't it go down? Huh? Oh, the floor is gone. Really? Hmm. Yeah, okay, my house is screwed. Okay, game, don't need to rub it in. Screw it. Screw you guys. Destroy it all. Ah! Let's try that again. I'm gonna make a quick one. I'm gonna make a quick one. Let's find a nice plot of land. I think this is perfect, actually. And um, we'll get this open, and we'll get our stone block cube. One, two, three, four. We got three by three house. That, that isn't that hard, is it? It's like a Minecraft house. Three by three. The basics. You know, you guys know what's up. Put that there. Put that there. Put that there. Out, 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 out. I need a door. I need a door, game. Where's my door? Perfect. Can we get some flooring in here, guys? Can we get some flooring? Where's the wooden floors at? Number four. Escape. Hit it with four. Hit it without. Boom. Boom. Get all those weeds out of the way. Can't have any of that. Huh. All right. So there's our floor. Lovely jubbly. Let's fly into the sky. Basic building. Awesome. Okay. Now, we need a roof. We need a roof. And I'm going to go for a tiled roof, to be honest. Because, well, that last roof did not go over quite well with me. No, no, get that out of here. Thankfully, I have that uh, structural integrity turned off. Or sorry, the dynamic building. Because that probably would have ruined me. Alright, let's see. I'm on a mission to build a house here. I'm a man on a mission. And then we'll put the five in there. Q. There we go. Come on. Sick. No, that's all good. Okay, we're a week around here, though. I'll tell you that much. We are a bit weak. Where are we weak, though? Let's stroll into my house. So, doop -a -doop -a -doop. in we go. But we're, we're structurally weak here. Why are we structurally weak there? Huh, I wonder if I should put some sort of support beam up. Will that work? Will that work? Do I need a support beam? I think I do. I think I do, personally. So... We got a wooden support beam. I guess timber is what we're looking for here. Five. If I hit alt, can I do this? Crap. Okay, get that timber. Oh my gosh, I missed that. I am horrible at placing. Go to that. So, let's look at the structural integrity now. It's still bad. Huh. What if I do this, right? No, not that.
What about that? Haha! -ha! You see, I am not. I'm, I'm actually kind of dumb, I will admit, but I'm not that dumb. So we put that there. We have th we have that three out from here. I know I can copy and paste, but I'd rather do it manually. Okay. No! Awesome. Are we good? I think we're good, guys. I think we're pretty good, right? Except for that awful support. Okay. I'm happy now. I'm happy. I'm happy. That'll do. Now, the question is, right? How do I fill... How do I fill the middle of that up? I assume it's a wooden slope I'm looking for here. Alright, so let's see what we got. Is this what I'm looking for? Alt. No, I meant to hit alt. You would think it was, okay? A normal person would think it was, right? Again. There we go. No, that's not what we want. That's good. I mean, it's out a bit, though. That's the question. What do we do at this point? And is there alternate versions? Aha, wooden top. Exactly what I need. Booyah! And then I assume all we need now is... A wall. So if I put number six... And I alt... And I put it... <gasps> Guys, I think we may have done it! Our ugly house! I may have put the blocks in the wrong place! No, 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 no! We're still alive, we're still kicking! We're still alive and kicking! Uh, number four. Number four. Huh? Yes, we want that. Out. Come on. Aha! Did you do it? No, I did not. <gasps> no, I took half the freaking thing away. That's what I wanted, though, all along. That, so they would all line up, but I need to get my roof back on now. The OST, for some reason, really reminds me of the anime Space and Wolf. I don't know, maybe it was set in medieval times as well. It was actually, but we'll leave that for another day. Man, look, look what, what's up with the roof, though? Is it just my awful building skills or what? I don't know, guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave that there though. <laughs> and I wanna while I'm here, actually, I wanna explore this windmill. So if I get if I go to G, we've got turn wheel, rope drum, wait. We got a windmill, rooter. Windmill blade. I think that's what we want. So, let's get done. I guess we want this, right? If I put that there, and I put that there, and then there I put, like, that. Does that work? Is that windmill blade on number four? No, it is not. Where's the windmill blade at? No, it's number four, three. Crap. I need something in the middle of it, though. It's tough, I tell ya. No, I don't think it's gonna go on. What about... What about... Oh, I put that there, and then... What, what's number five, by the way? Oh, it's a trebuchet. Well, you can build a trebuchet, I heard. We'll probably do that in a future episode. I just wanna get this thing rotating today! <laughs> Let's see. 
I guess I could probably use the timber, right? Just for an example. Let's see, so if I rotate that... What's an action key? How do you, how, what's the action key? Um, compound? No, it won't be compound. Block picking, I would assume. B? No. <laughs> action key! Which one are you? Uh, down, blah, blah, blah. I shouldn't be saying blah, blah, blah. T, T, hit T. I mean, we're doing something, but... Okay, I've got a lot of work to do. I have a lot of work to do, guys. I'm a newbie, as you can see. But, uh, hopefully you enjoyed it. Hopefully that gave you a brief look at Medieval Engineers. Again, I hopefully will be doing some multiplayer content when this, when it comes out, with my, my, a few of my friends. But I've got a little bit to improve on, so maybe I'll do a little mini-series, just improving. Uh, I am a newbie builder, as you all know. Uh, yeah, definitely worth a look. Check it out on Steam, guys. Early access. Looks promising. Definitely looks promising. So this is uh, Pyro signing out. Have a very nice day, and I shall see you guys next time. Bye-bye.